Here's how to create picture-in-picture -picture videos just like this. Start by heading over to clipchamp.com and then log in or create your free account. I've put the link in the description below. Once logged in, you'll be taken to the homepage where you'll click on the create a new video button and then you'll be taken straight into the editor. First thing you'll need to do is import your video clips by heading over to the import media button, selecting the assets and hitting open. They'll then load into your media library over here. Now load your media into the timeline by dragging and dropping each asset in one above the other, just like this. For the video you'd like to layer on top as the picture in picture, make sure to place it above your other video in the timeline. The video at the bottom will be the background asset. Now the videos are in the timeline. To make your video an overlay, click on the top asset in your timeline and it will highlight in green so that you know it's selected. Then navigate up to the floating toolbar in the stage. Click on the see more option and then select the picture in picture button. Now you can choose where you'd like your video overlay to appear on the screen by selecting either the top left, top right, bottom left or bottom right options. If you do want to place it somewhere else, you can go ahead and use the freehand tool to move the asset anywhere on the screen just like this. Now by dragging the corners, you can change the size of the asset until you're completely happy with it. I'll hit playback and it will look something like this to begin with. Lastly, you can add a filter to your overlay to change the video's aesthetic. Just click on the asset in the timeline and navigate over to the property panel. Then click into the filters option, then go ahead and preview each filter by hovering over it. Once you've found the one that you want to use, simply select it to action the adjustment. You can also adjust the intensity of that filter by dragging the intensity slider left or right. You can also adjust the exposure, the contrast, the saturation and the transparency of the asset over here in the adjust colors tab in the property panel. Just move each of the sliders left or right to adjust each option until you're happy with the look of the asset. If you've made a mistake, just hit the reset button and it will go back to its original state. You can also do this for the other asset by following the same steps. Once you're completely happy with your video, you can go ahead and export it by heading to the export button selecting your video quality and then once the export is complete hit save to your computer and it will download straight to your device all ready for you to share and that's how to create a picture in picture video if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for our weekly how-to videos